like, all right, let's just calm down. You're, you're, you're having a reaction. That's understandable. It's the nerd in you talking. Why don't we start over? How many of my dresses would you like to order? None. Not one. Okay, look. I'm not going to take no for an answer because I, I, I just refuse to do that because I'm a winner. And winners, we don't listen to words like, like no or, or don't or stop. <laughs> Okay, you know what, Father? I'm just gonna plow ahead because I'm sensing some resistance. And Dennis always tells me, never let someone's resistance stop you from getting what you want. So. Good looking guy like myself, takes pride in his personal appearance, takes pride in his personal hygiene, has great hair. You know, you put a guy like that behind the bar, people will eventually flock to this man. That, that's what you're saying, yeah. That's what you're saying. Boys are out tonight, huh? Like ass play, he'll do anything with the ass. The whole purpose of buying the boat in the first place was to get the ladies nice and tipsy topside so we can take them to a nice, comfortable place below deck and, you know, they can't refuse because of the implication. Oh, uh, okay. You had me go in there for the first part. The second half kind of threw me. Well, dude, dude, th think about it. She's out in the middle of nowhere with some dude she barely knows. You know, she looks around her. What does she see? Nothing but open ocean. Ah, uh, there's nowhere for me to run. What am I going to do? Say no? Okay, that, <laughs> <laughs> that seems really dark. No, no, I mean, it's not dark. You're misunderstanding me, bro. I'm, okay. I'm, I think I am. Yeah, you are. <laughs> because if the girl said no, then the answer obviously is no. No. But the right. thing is, is she's not going to say yeah. no. She would never say no because of the implication. Now, you, you've said that word implication a couple of times. What, what implication? The implication that things might go wrong for her if she refuses to sleep with me. Now, not that things are going to go wrong for her, but she's thinking that they will. But it sounds like she doesn't want to have Why sex. Why aren't you with understanding? This? I don't. She she doesn't know whether she wants to have sex with me. It's that she doesn't. That's know. not the issue. Are you going to hurt? Be a, I'm not going to hurt oh, these women. Okay. Why would I ever hurt these women? I, don't know. I feel like you're not getting this at all. I'm at not all. getting it. God damn. Well, don't you look at me like that. You certainly wouldn't be in any danger. So they are in danger. No one's in any danger. How can I make that any more clear to you? Okay, it's an implication of oh. danger. Oh, hello. Wow. Sorry. Didn't mean to scare you there. Anyway, I, um, I should have introduced myself earlier. I'm the Daiquiri Man. But I suspect you already knew that, didn't you? Was it good? Was it sweet? I guess. Well, it either was or it wasn't. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Yeah, no, I had one too. It was, it was sweet. You seem sweet. Been watching you following you of sorts, you know, in a good way. So how'd you like that magic show? Do you enjoy magic? You know, I, I can do magic. Whoop. How did you get, get that? Get your license? Don't worry about it. 1996, though. That's good. That makes the cutoff. There you go. I was going to steal it. <clears throat> um, so how about this storm, huh? I think it's kind of cool, you know? Here we are on a boat, you know, out in the middle of, out in the middle of nowhere. Nobody would ever hear our screams and this wind. You know. Oh, <laughs> uh, the thunder is really is throwing this whole thing off. You know, it's making everything I say seem sinister, which it's not intended to be. You know. What's yeah, up? I, I'm sorry. I have no, to no, 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 no. Sorry, no. It's there's nowhere to go. <laughs> there's really nowhere to go. You know, so. Why don't I uh, come in your room? Come in your room. That's not what I meant. 
I would like to go in your room. Um, and I suspect that maybe you might say no, and yet, I also feel like maybe you wouldn't dare. Yeah, sure, okay. Yeah, well, if I wasn't the coolest guy in school, then why did you have to try and tear me down by sleeping with my prom date? No, I, I didn't sleep with your prom date. Yes, you did! No, I didn't. Ronnie the Rat did. Wait, what? Ronald McDonald slept with your prom date. Did he tell you that I slept with her? I never would have slept with that <laughs> chick. She was gross. 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 I remember that. She was gross. Yeah, you slept with my prom date? No. Yes. How could you do that to me? It was very easy. Uh, she was a whore. I'm gonna kill you. No, I'm don't gonna kill you. Wait, no, I'm gonna kill you, you fat piece of shit! This is mass! This is mass! Don't make her fall my way! You guys are good. Hey, no, she was a whore! Stop it! My whore! Calm down! Now, once you've had sex with the woman, she will naturally start to depend on you, okay? All women do this. They certainly do. You got that right. Sex right. with women. Once you bang them. Like girl. that. Right. Right. Which brings me to the first N. Nurturing dependence. You're going to want to nurture that dependence that she's feeling on you now, guys. Have her car towed. Or you can slash her tires. Either way, make her depend on you for rides. Or you can use my personal go-to, which is to create a fictional angry neighbor who's threatening her and tell her you'll take care of him. Hit up a payphone so that she can't trace the calls back to you. Give her a call and say something along the lines of, I'm watching you, you bitch. You're gonna die tonight. <laughs> oh, for Christ's sake, you're a complete sociopath. Don't interrupt. <laughs> I'm not sure I understand what's happening. I'm schizophrenic. D, mm. I swear you would be of more use to me if I skinned you and turned your skin into a lampshade. Or fashioned you into a piece of high-end luggage. I can even add you to my collection. Are you saying that you have a collection of skin luggage? Of course I'm not, D. Don't be ridiculous. Think of the smell. You haven't thought of the smell, you bitch! Now you say another word and I swear to God I will dice you into a million little pieces and put those pieces in a box, a glass box that I will display on my mantle. All right, now that that's settled, we can have a normal conversation. I have contained my rage for as long as possible, but I shall unleash my fury upon you like the crashing of a thousand waves. Be gone, vile man, be gone from me. A starter car, this car is a finisher car, a transporter of gods, the golden god. I am untethered and my rage knows no bounds. I'm a monster man! Hurricane party is exactly what it sounds like. It's a party during a hurricane at our bar, Patty's Pub. Oh, I'm part of that bar. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> Hello! <laughs> all right, all right, hi. Crazy, uh, crazy weather coming our way. Yeah. You trying to get these girls down in the bunker? Yeah. Right? Oh, no, I'm, 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 I'm inviting them back to our very cool bar. Oh, yeah. cool, cool. Yeah, 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 we got a sweet bunker, too, yeah. man. Yeah. It's, like, so secure. People can't get in or out if we don't want them to. We'll be, like, totally safe down there. Yeah. I got a bunch of supplies. You guys like pickled eggs? <laughs> <laughs> Sardines. Yeah, we got a bunch of other, you know, normal food and normal stuff there, yeah. too. Yeah, it's a great bar. Gonna be free drinks for everybody, so, you know, you'll come, you'll party with us, and you, you bring your girlfriends, too, you know? Sure. We don't want just the two of you. You gotta bring your girlfriends. That's a requirement. Sounds like fun. Can our boyfriends come, too? Oh. Your boyfriends? Yeah, our boyfriends. Do you have boyfriends? How did you not know that the reason I invited you back to my bar was to bang you? Get out of here. Get the hell out of here. Get, get out of here. Shoot away from me. You're a dick. You're a dick. She's a, I'm not a dick. Oh. Mac, it's that sort of we've thing. got it covered, okay, D? 
Your bicycle helmet. Later, boners. That's an awesome helmet. What? Go out. Hello. Hi. Um, I'm a recovering crackhead. This is my retarded sister that I take care of. I'd like some welfare, please. You're a recovering crack addict. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Once the guests arrive, we will ply them with liquor, and then I will present to them this peace treaty that I will have them sign. Why do you always want people to sign creepy documents? <laughs> well, Frank, once something's in writing, that means it's set in stone. Then no one can do anything to stop me. I don't know, this is bad, dude. What you got here, what you working on? Oh, uh, this is great, this is an agreement for the women. Yeah, oh. it uh, guarantees that whoever comes back to the bar with us agrees to follow all the rules that we set forth. Well, that's smart, walk me through the details. What you got uh, there? It's all very simple, Charlie, very simple stuff. Um, I state your name. Charlie Kelly! Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, not your name, huh? their name. <laughs> Being of sound mind and body, do solemnly pledge that I do not have a boyfriend, nor am I currently engaged in a sexual relationship with another individual, females excluded. Right. Uh, I hereby agree to be easygoing, mm. to engage in playful conversation, to always act as though I desire your penis, even when I don't. Yeah. And it sort of goes on and on like that for a while. Okay. I love it! It only takes one germ, D. Oh, Jesus. Of course, how anybody thinks that a germ could survive a scalding hot pizza is beyond me. <laughs> oh, Dennis, you don't look good. Trust me, D. If I found myself getting sick, I would simply say, Sick the speed gun! Don't you tell me to calm down. Oh, God. There's that chirping again. How are you not hearing that? News flash, asshole! I've been hearing it the entire goddamn time! Then why wouldn't you say something? Because I hate you! Oh my God. Why did I hear squeal? Oh, no, dude, why are you bleeding? Dennis scratched me. Mac was doing that thing where he tries to casually bring something up to me like I don't notice. Come to me like a man. Talk about being tough all the time. Can't even look me in the eyes. Okay. How's this for shoes, Charlie? Oh, no, Frank, come on, man. You're gonna get black paint everywhere. I've changed my mind about the stool. No, no stool. Stool's out. No way! It's just that it was my idea, Dennis. It's sort of like the jean shorts, you know, where you feel... Look at me when you're talking to me! What do I really want? Do I really want? What do you want more than anything else in the entire world? Okay, what do I want more than anything else in this entire world? Yes. Crack. Oh, oh. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say pizza or... Yeah, no, no, no. Buffalo wings or no. something. You want crack? Yeah, crack cocaine. Now, I've never had crack. Dude, you are going to love it. I am. What's happening? I'll tell you what's happening. One day you're young and pretty, and the next... The years of drinking and abuse have robbed you of your youth. Abuse? Did these guys hurt you? Ah, uh, no. Me husband did this to me. Arr! D. Mm. What the hell are you doing? What are you, what, are you a pirate? Or, I can't tell if you're doing a thing now or if this is just who you've become. I'm giving them an authentic Irish experience like you were begging for before you're, you're when you are giving them a completely inauthentic, frightening experience and you're scaring them, okay? Listen, ladies, nobody's gonna get hurt. Will you just let us out, please? Well, no. No, I'm not going to let you out. I need you to experience everything I, I have to offer, okay? So you're ex so experiencing it. D, mm -hmm. shut up! All right, look, it's, we're going to have a good time here, okay? You're experiencing some free beers right now because I can't get the goddamn internet to work. That's a problem for me. Do you guys know how to use tablet computers? You're young. I just want to connect the goddamn thing to the internet. They told me it'd be easy. It's not, though. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. I'll let you out after I take a, a, a couple photographs of you. How, how's that sound? Yeah, take some photographs for my for my website. So, look happy, look like you're having fun. No need to cover those up. My customers like those. They're like me, they're gonna wanna see that. Okay, so smiling, smiling, and... <laughs> you're not convincing me, smile! God damn it! This is not supposed to be scary. This is supposed to be an authentic fun time for you. Yeah, all right, well, I need to buy it. <laughs> Well, if you don't comply with me, then you're gonna end up on the weird one, okay? So smile! Don't do it, he's got you brainwashed. Go! Dennis! Play! Go! Stay! Get up there! Stay! Now! Stay! Now! Stay! Wait! You're gonna get us, man! Stop, stop, stop! Please stop hitting me so I can think for a second! You see? 
This is bad. You got him thinking for himself again. You know what else is bugging me about this guy? Huh. I cannot get past the fact that we're perfect strangers. He doesn't know me. I mean, for all this guy knows, I'm a psychopath with a trunk full of chainsaws, right? He shushes me because he doesn't like the volume of my conversation. Huh. Next thing he knows, he's chopped the bits in the basement somewhere, you know? Mm. Was that worth it? No, I mean, I could be a man with a fistful of hammers right. and a trunk full of duct tape and zip ties. You know, this guy doesn't know me. Is he crazy? Yeah, yeah we will. Son of a bitch. Oh, you bastard. Bastards! Oh, Jesus Christ! Yeah. Dennis, you're coming out hot! Uh, I am the king of the minions, not Tim Murphy, not that jerk-off idiot! Hey, you jerk-off! What the hell are you doing, man? She rejected me! Me, Frank, me, the coolest guy in the history of this goddamn school! Oh, they're all gonna pay! They're all gonna pay the ultimate price! Whoa! Oh. Dude, what's all that stuff you're grabbing? Tools! Tools, duct tape, zip ties, and gloves. I have to have my tools. Well, why do you have a bunch of like weird tools in a hidden compartment in your car? It's fetish, it's fetish shit. I, 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 I like to bind. I like to be bound. I got. Uh, that's not important. Don't ask me questions. I'm not taking questions. The golden god is not taking questions. I am the golden god. I, I'm taking action. I gotta go. I gotta well, go. All right, run out and hook in. Run out and hook in. Show these people how to play football. I'm gonna make Mac look so bad. My form is perfect. I'm like Jerry Rice. Feel that stride. So fluid and fast. I've got the stride of a gazelle. A beautiful, beautiful gazelle person. My body is achieving a perfect symmetry right now. It's that long, lean muscle I've worked so hard to achieve. I should have popped my shirt off. God damn it. I really should have popped that shirt off. I wonder if any women are watching from the sidelines. Oh, Merge, Merge! You had your... Come on, you gotta you seize the goddamn gap! People are so goddamn inefficient! Oh, goddamn it! I don't care if you're old, seize the gap! You old fat bitch! You fat bitch! Hello, Mac. How are you? What are you doing, dude? Why don't you have a seat? Uh, enjoy a cookie, have some iced tea. Okay. Who are you here to see? My friend Sandy. Oh, Sandy. Sandy, huh? Is Sandy a young, attractive, blonde girl? I have no idea. Uh, Sandy, why don't you come out here, please? Oh, mm. hello, Mac. Not so young and attractive, is she? What? Must be a big disappointment. Whatever! What, what are you guys even doing here? Why don't you go back to your fancy pool? We're fine. Fancy pool got old after a while. Wait a second. You guys didn't get into the pool, did you? What? Oh, oh my God, you sons of bitches! You didn't get in! Us? Admit that you were low class just like us! I'm not admitting shit, because I did get into that pool. I just got tired of swimming in it. All right, then why are you here? Why would we... Why are you wait, piping wait. in, trash? You shut your mouth, trash! No, why are you trash? calling me trash? Because I you're... defended you earlier because they're shorts! You're the ones that are trash, sitting in the bottom of a pool that's filled with trash, like trash! Boy, it's been hot. It's hot, huh? Yeah. It is super hot. Yeah. It's getting real hot around here. So hot, Wally. But you don't really know what hot is, do you? Hot's a storm. You ever been in a storm, Wally? I mean, a real storm? Not a thunderstorm, but a storm of fists raining down on your head, blasting you in the face, pummeling you in the stomach, hitting you in the chest, so hard, you think your heart's gonna stop. You ever been in a storm like that, Wally? <laughs> Dennis. I've never had my hair cut in a bedroom. Well, one thing I've learned from cutting hair all these years, Danielle, is you don't have to go to a high-end salon to get a high-end salon quality cut. Why are we watching Dennis's sex tape? Uh, shh. <laughs> it's cold. I know. Well, we'll make it hot in a minute. Don't worry about that. <laughs> Let's mm. get into that. Well, don't, well, don't there's always so much, so much preamble. OK, here we go. Oh, oh, um, all right. All right. Whoa. Now, Dennis, how does this make you feel? <laughs> Powerful. Yes, of course. But how does it affect you sexually? 
I'm very aroused right now. I too am aroused. I'm starting to swell up. Yeah. See, now all three of us are aroused, and there's not a woman in the room. See, this is no different than sports or video games. It's all a virtual experience. No, 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 bullshit. Yeah, this was real, okay? This happened, I did this. All right, I drew this woman in, I styled her hair, I entered her with almost no resistance. I did these things. You say it's real, but what even is reality? Yeah, who knows? We don't even know if we're in this room. We could be in a turtle's dream in outer space. Look, dude, you've been bugging me all night, okay? I think your costume's weird, I think you're creepy, and I just want you to leave me alone. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. Dude, costume is so sexy. What? I can't believe it, man. She takes advantage of me. She's like, oh my God, you look so sexy. I'm going to sex you all up. I'm like, you're just my friend. Get your sex on me. And then she gets all sexy with me because I'm like, got the sexiest costume in the world. I'm going to eat it. Well, so what do you, what, do you want to get rid of that costume? Yes, I'll... I want to get rid of the costume. You know I just, it's like to be the sexy. I can't have your costume, dude. Yeah, you can have really? it. Really? You switch sexy. costumes with me? Yeah. Let's switch, let's switch. <laughs> Come on, let's go switch. You'll be okay, buddy. Yes, dude, it's all coming back to me now. You came over to me and we agreed to switch costumes. You gave me your sexy, sexy costume and I was able to fell the seductive temptress finally. Oh, yes, yeah, so I did have sex with the peacock lady. Yeah, awesome. Oh, that's so awesome, dude. Well, mystery solved. I mean, awesome. That's not the mystery. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That you banged the peacock chick is not the mystery. The D thing is the mystery. I've been meaning to speak to you about this. I can't read these words. They're not in the right order. It's good. I think you might be dyslexic, bro. I'm not reading this. I'm gonna... No, 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 no please. I, I, I think it. you might be dyslexic. Just read the script once. Okay, you want me to read the script? Yes. All right. And action. I'll read the words you wrote. Hello, fellow American. This you should vote me. I leave power. Good. Thank you. Thank you. If you vote me, I'm hot. What? Taxes. They'll be lower. Son, the Democratic vote for me is right thing to do, Philadelphia. So do. This doesn't make any sense. It's your universe. It's my universe. And you are God. I am God. Was I a person of interest? Yeah, I am an interesting person. No, he's not here, and that's why I need you to do it for me. Please, please. Oh, Jesus, just eat it with the skin I on. do not like it with the skin, Dee. I'm not allowed to eat it with the skin. I'm not allowed! Oh, my God. All right. If you just shut up, I will peel the apple for you the way that Mac likes you to eat it. Give it to me. Give it to me! I'll do it the way that Mac insists. <laughs> what? Like. Yeah, I like that. Dayman! Day Dayman. Fighter of the night, man! Champion of the Sun! Sun! You're a master of karate! And friendship <laughs> for everyone! A Dayman! That's it! Dayman! Oh! Fighter of the night, man! Oh! Champion of, of the sun! sun. <laughs> oh! You're a master of karate and friendship for everyone. Dayman! Dayman! Oh, nice, we'll get the... Fighter of the night, man! Oh, champion of the sun! Prepare to experience sexual magic. Dayman! Oh! It wasn't until I reviewed the interrogation footage later that I saw it. Something very unsettling.
24 years on the job. I've never seen anything like it. Two hours. Never moved. Never blinked. Gives me goosebumps just thinking about it. He had all the right answers. But my gut told me this guy was guilty. Okay, you know what? I, this is nuts. I gotta, I, I just gotta go. It's done. It's done, guys. Goodbye, Patty's Pub. Goodbye, Philadelphia. Goodbye, Charlie. Mac, D, Frank. The bar is done. Please don't do that. Save your breath, Ingrid. Those words have never worked on me. I'll see you tomorrow.